Aiko, um, do you confirm again that you you come in the love and light of the infinite creator? Uh, we are Guo. The instrument has expressed repeated concern about the contact that it was receiving and has swift and discerning judgment about if such an entity that is in contact may be positive or negative. In this, we would like to put the instrument's uh, weary considerations at rest, for we are quo, and we come in the love and light of the infinite creator. Thanks, quo. Um, yeah, I'm, I guess the main thing that I want to ask about is like, this feeling that I'm getting, um, where it seems like I'm sort of coming more into a positive personal disposition, like inviting gratitude more and like being happier. Um, yeah, I'm just curious, like what's going on there? Like what's the process and if there's any way that it could be improved? Uh, we are quo. The process, as it is referred to by this entity, is not a easily distinguished pattern. Rather, in each moment, this entity chooses to move towards love and light of the infinite creator, and thus aligns itself with the vibration of the eternal infinite that is always available for entities with a similar frequency interest. Is there a distinguishable, like a a important difference between like in terms of healing Gaia and benefiting the beings on earth uh, as well as the beings outside of earth um, between um, sort of doing these sessions and uh, not being very fastidious about sharing them and doing these sessions and being fastidious and like doing everything, like putting everything up and sharing it and trying to promote it and stuff like that. Uh, we are quo. This entity has again mistaken the insubstantial for the substantial in that there is not a singular way or method that there is a that gives an entry point to the benefit that the earth or its inhabitants may receive, but rather the infinite cascade of eternal light that pours forth from the creator is infinitely diffracting into myriad forms. Thus, we would caution the entity known as Hanjo to not see things in terms of this diffractive, potentiated individual circumstance. In other words, posting, not posting, or making available, not available, or being fastidious, not fastidious, and would rather direct the entity to continue its dispositional shift towards love and light and make that the primary interest of the entity. Um, would 
would it be correct to say that then I should be like orienting from the time space perspective primarily? We are quo. This is a insightful and piercing insight and question. It is absolutely correct with no stipulations otherwise that it is correct to orient from the time space perspective. For this is indeed the only perspective that continues through the incarnational cycle. We would advise the entity with warmth and love that it is it has already made substantial progress in this regard and can trust itself in continuing this approach. Um, after the sessions, I've noticed a significant energy shift in my energy, um, and I'm curious what the cause of that is. We are quo. This entity, um, we find this entity humorous in its pretend game of producing questions that it knows the answer to, as well, well known by the entity we correct the instrument well connected with by the entity we our frequency is consuming and inhabiting this entity's vibration and directing it further towards love light Oh my god, that's so funny. Fuck. Oh shit. Um. Hmm. Mm. I just say I'm very grateful for this contact, and I want it to continue for as long as it can. Uh. And I'm curious about um I mean, I, well, actually no, that's what I want to say, yeah. Well, no, I am curious about like if there's things that I can do which will help sustain the contact over a longer period of time. Uh we are quo. We as a parent would to a child give this entity warm praise and Thanks for its expression to continue this channel and contact. But in the same way, we would say as a parent to a child that their naivete may uh, influence their viewpoint on this matter to a so, so that their perspective is is warped uh, uh, due to their ignorance of how things are happening in the universe. There is no question of sustaining or not sustaining this contact and of making it better and worse. These are space-time oriented questions. Uh, In essence, we would say that the uh, contact has already happened and will continue to happen in the same way as it has already happened. We would gently direct this entity towards the infinite light of the creator in this for this aspect or inquiry.
Riakpo. We would offer that this entity may need some time to reflect on the answers given to produce more queries that would be useful. Uh, however, we would happily open the floor to any other questions, despite their perceived substantiality or insubstantiality by this entity, and would like to remind this entity that it is the one who is receiving this contact, not others. Thus, it should have some confidence in its own ability to formulate questions and ask them, despite its own perspective on if they are good or bad questions. Thanks. Um, so when I'm sort of like posting online sometimes, I'm feeling like my mm, cheek energy, and I'm curious what that cheek energy is. We are quo. This energy is that from the knees uh, energy that it, this entity is familiar with and rises in A presence in the body when this entity seeks to speak or produce direction or concepts from this knee energy that makes a shit ton of sense um So I have like this awareness of the lower body energies and I can also like introduce a lot of other people to them and most people don't have awareness of them. Um, and I noticed in like the rare context is not in there either apart from like mentioned as secondaries. I'm curious what the place of these lower body energies is. Uh, we are quo. Each energy center identified by the one known as Hanjo, including those of the arm, are primary energy centers that are suitable for transmission of energies between the entity and the galactic menagerie of entities that make themselves available to it. Thus, there is no difference between each center. Rather, it is just a receptivity point to obtain different frequencies from the galactic menagerie of entities. Um, is it appropriate to understand these in terms of the labels that I was given originally, like fear, like anger, and uh, insecurity, confusion, uh, you know, um, Selfishness, shadow, malice, we are quo. These labels, although having s some small substance, are not entirely accurate. We would direct this entity to be aware of what is received inward through these chakras, rather than what is generated within. We are quo. We thank this entity for this contact, but suggest that it may want to catch the bus as it is considers as time has flown by. Um, okay, thanks, quo. Yeah, uh, I really appreciate this contact and. Thank you for offering it. We are quo. We thank the one known as Hanjo for this contact. 